Okay. Woo. Well, look at what we got here, guys. A couple of boxes. So, you know what we're doing today? Unboxing. All right, guys, so as you can see, I got three boxes here, and today we're going to be doing an unboxing. I bought some things uh, for my studio, and uh, let's just see what we got here. First up, top, is a, uh, it's a new GoPro. Uh, I have one. Where is it? Oh, here's my original GoPro. It's a Hero 3 Plus. Really good. Uh, it still works and everything, but, uh, you know, it's kind of old and outdated. So, decided I uh, needed to get a new one. So, what I got here... Okay, so it's the GoPro Hero 11 Black Action Camera. So, that's cool. Let's, uh, let's really quickly open this up and see what we got in here. So, let's see. Can this thing... Oh. Okay, so I just lightly peel this up. Yeah, there we go. Boom, there we go. All right. So we have the box here. I'll make sure to get a uh, footage of this going around. But on the front it says GoPro 11. Uh, I guess it says black. With a nice picture of the GoPro up front uh, on the side. You got a little list of, of its uh, qualities. Uh, 27 MP. I don't know what that means. But it okay. Looks like we got 5.3K at 60 frames. Or 4K at 120 frames. Or 2.7K K at 240 frames per second. Since it's waterproof up to 33 feet or 10 meters. Since it's voice controlled. Very nice. Says eight times slow motion. Okay. Says, uh, let's see. Data overlays. All right. Nice. Time warp. That's cool. Uh, 1080p live streaming. Very, very nice. Uh, let's see. Super photo plus HDR plus raw photos. Okay. GP2 processing, web webcam mode, and mod ready. On the back, not a not a whole lot. Just a picture of the GoPro and a picture of a couple of clouds. So I guess you can upload this to the to the cloud. Uh, and then on the last side. A picture of the GoPro, the battery, and a couple of uh, attachments, plus the the powering cord and a case. All right, so let us open up the case, and you know what? Just for a little added bonus, I'm going to film the B-roll with my GoPro here. So, all right, so I got you going. Now, here we go. As you can see, got a nice, got this nice case. Very nice. Let's uh, open this up. Ooh. Sounds nice. All right. So, here we go. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. All right, so we got the charging cable. Very nice. got a clip looks like some m3 tape so i can stick this on all right got a screw i'm assuming this be the battery yes sir that looks like the battery to me and the clip to clip this on so this slides into here 
and uh, yeah. yeah, that just slides into there like that. All right, and then here's the GoPro. Wow. Uh, for a reference, size difference. There you go. Once again, I'll I'll take a picture of this. Um, but yeah, yeah, it's nice. Uh, I believe this one has a screen on the back. All right, that's cool. Let's see, is there anything underneath here? No, so just a nice little steady in. Okay, with that done. <clears throat> Time for box number two. All right, so this is a kind of a bigger box. Uh, let's see what's in here using the green knife. All right, now remember, always cut away from yourself. Because you don't want to cause any injuries. All right, so let's see what's in here. Oh! Let me show you guys what I got. So, as you can see right here, I got a Helix HX Stomp in the limited purple edition. Here, let's see if we can't pull this out of the box. Packing styrofoam, okay. All right, Put that back in there. Yes. So I got an HX stomp with the limited purple edition. And just uh, looking at the box here, oh, it's uh, wow, it doesn't really say much on the front. Just a nice picture. Side HX. Side HX stomp, or that's the bottom, I should say. Top, it's like a top, shows us a layout of one of the sides. Okay. The back, the actual back of it. You got the HX stomp, compact professional guitar processor. Okay. MIDI in, uh, send, returns, okay effects loop all right well let's pull this bad boy out and actually see what it looks like in person We go. We go. Moment of truth. Paperwork. <laughs> yeah. All right. All right. All right. Cool. We'll read this later, but let's see what's actually in here. Okay. So we got some nice packing styrofoam. Go with this box right here, which has the uh, nine volt battery supply. Battery. 9 volt DC power supply. Okay, power supply. It's cool. Let's actually see what's in here. The green knife is getting a lot of use today. can't just all right let's put this down really quickly I want to see what type of power supply this has 
I know it's a knife. There we go. All right. Okay. Oh, okay, just a, a regular power. Oh, push. Oh, check that nonsense out. Okay, so I guess if, you know, you're traveling internationally or whatnot, you can just, instead of having to buy a whole new power supply, you can just buy one of these adapters. Because, you know, different places have different plugs, so. Boom. All right. Back in. And we got, let's see, our cable. USB to whatever this side is. All right. But, oh, wow. Look at this. Let me show you guys. Look at that. Mmm. Woo. That's a... It's pretty purple. So, all right. Let's see. Um, okay, so... One of the reasons why I got uh, this HX Stomp is because uh, one of my friends is starting a new band and he asked me to, to play bass in it. And, uh, you know, I, I decided, well, a new project, new bass, time to try out one of these uh, modelers. So this is my first modeler. Um, so, yeah, I'm going to come up with my whole entire base rig and everything like that on this sounds and everything. So it's going to be good. Good times. Uh, I'll definitely shoot a video of me uh, going through this and figuring it all out. Um, the, one of the reasons why I got purple though, very simple. Everyone has black. So when I saw that there was a few random colors out there besides black, there was blue, there was white, but then I came across this purple at Sweetwater, and I knew I'm going to get this because, you know, I don't like to have the same thing that everyone else has. You know, it's just, it's just very, it's just not me. You know, I like to stand out a little bit. So this is very, very nice. One more time, let's just look at that. Very purple. Very purple. So now I know if I ever go to a gig and someone else has one of these, um, like I said, 95% of the time, theirs is going to be black, possibly blue. But I know this purple one is mine. All right. Last box. So this is a pretty big box. And uh, just so you guys can tell, it's from Amazon. Yeah. So we're going to go here. Green knife time. All right, here we go. Oh, another box. Oh, I was I was mistaken. It's not just cut down, taped down the middle. It's also taped on the sides. And as you guys can see here, uh, it's got these straps on it. So, time to cut the straps. Time to take the second box out. Now, just in case you guys can't make it out, but right here it says Sound Town. Sound Town. So here we go. Gonna cut this box open. See what's inside. Yep, 
Here we go. You won't believe it. But it's another box! Let's do this all over again. All right, here we go. Moment of truth. Bubble wrap. Okay, bubble wrap and some stuff. Oh, I know what this is. Yeah, hold on. So, what this is right here, let me turn it around. This is a, this is a sound town uh, rack mounted drawer that I got for, uh, you know, over there for my rack, my studio rack. Sounds like some things are inside where they should be. So, yeah, let's go ahead and peel off all the tape so like i said uh, i got this studio drawer to just a because i needed more storage space in my studio and uh yeah also this one is a locking one i'm not so sure if you can see it right here right there but there's a lock i'll make sure to get get a close-up of that but I'm assuming all the keys and stuff like that are are on the inside so let me take off all this tape and open it up there also should be something else inside so yeah all right so before we go any further I just noticed that one of the the rack ears the rack mounts is bent like that. I might have to return this, but we'll see what happens. Maybe I can bend it back. But anyways, let's keep going. All right, so it's a little tough gain open, which is nice. Let's nice see. Uh, as you can see here, it says "Thank you for purchasing." Satisfied? Not satisfied? Please give. Uh, please give us your opinion. Blah 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 blah. All right. It's this 10% discount promo code. Wow, very nice. As you can see here, we got foam. So. Oh. nice padded foam as you can see it's cutted so uh, that way I can put things uh, make cutouts for it but where are the keys There they are. Keys were on the bottom. All right, cool. So I got keys. Make sure they lock. All right, guys. Well, that's everything. Um, got this great looking, uh, you know, rack mounted drawer. Got the amazing Helix HX Stomp and a new gopro as far as packing wise goes um all of these things were packed 
very, very sufficiently. Um, even though this is bent, this rack mount here, even though it's bent, uh, I'm not so sure if that had to do with in route or or whatnot because you guys saw this thing was in three boxes and wrapped up in bubble wrap and, and everything else. So especially with, you know, these these styrofoam edges here. So I don't know if this happened at the factory warehouse or before or or while in transit. So but everything else, you know, is legit. Like I said, stick around. Uh, be looking for a video on this. Um, probably not going to dive a whole lot into this because these things are, I don't want to say old, but these things have been around the block and there's a whole lot of in-depth uh, videos on this. But, you know, watch me come up with a new sound for, for this new project that I'm going to be working on. Uh, be expecting me to be using this uh, more out and about over my old Hero 3. But I mean, I, I still will be taking this one out. It's always good to have two cameras. And uh, yeah, uh, but for now, I'm going to see if I can put this in my rack. And if not, I'm going to have to think about uh, sending this back home. But that's all the time we have for today, guys. Until next time, I'm Black Boy in a Band. And remember, keep practicing. Well, guys, that's all the time we have for today. I hope you guys like this video. If you guys have any comments or suggestions, jot them down in the comment section below. I'll throw up some more videos that I think you guys might like. One that's uh, my last video and just another video. Also, feel, feel free to subscribe. I do put out new content every other Tuesday, or at least I try to in these crazy times. Um, also, go ahead and like this video. That helps me out. Uh, and, you know, go ahead, share this video if you think it might help someone else out. Once again, guys, thanks for all you do. I'm Black Boy in the Band, and just remember, keep practicing.